This is take. This is take two movie review. I'm Clinton Johnston. This week, holy crap, they did it. Well, it's almost 20 years after Fox's X-Men, a little over 10 years after Marvel Studios released Iron Man, and seven years after Joss Whedon showed us what a movie about a team really looked like, and all I could think as I watched Avengers Endgame, as setups from movies released years ago were getting paid off, as, dear God please, Marvel finally resolves its daddy issues, was, my God, the scope of this thing. I mean, the three-hour runtime was a good call. It allowed them to continue the Marvel genre experiment by crafting a heist film that was also an homage to Back to the Future 2, that was also an homage to the Marvel franchise, and have that all be just a part of a movie about grief and resilience and about how the cold objectivism of Thanos may indeed save the universe, but it is the core-rooted dedication to those we love which will save our souls. You decide which is more worthy. And I'm sorry, if you want someone who's going to tell you everything that's wrong with this film, then go to the internet. There you will find Think Peace After Dissection by scores of damaged people who, due to America's pathetic, horrendous neglect of artistic education, believe that the only way to deal with an artistic event is to see if they can tear it down. I'm here to tell you that that first thought was my last critical thought, while I had Endgame sweep me up in a way that hasn't happened since I was a kid, and I'm grateful for it. And I wasn't alone, as my off-peak theater audience gasped and cheered and clapped. And if you're not an action-adventure fantasy which is trying hard to shed its history of masculinist, white supremacist, bias type person, then that's okay. You don't have to like it. You be you. But regardless, Phase 1 and 2 of the Marvel Cinematic Universe is going to go down in film history, and Avengers Endgame is going to be the jewel of the crowd. This has been Take-Two Movie Review. I'm Clinton Johnston. Catch up with us at take 2 and feed us back on our page on YouTube.